don't have an attitude problem. You have a perception problem. Miss Grant's on her way up. Okay, um, uh, t today we have to seem really, really normal. Like, like, not just normal, normal, but super normal. Oh, but no, Are no super. Are you having a stroke? What, is this what a stroke looks like? It... Miss Grant thinks I'm super girl. What? what? I will handle it. Uh, but if she sees us acting weird, it's gonna blow everything. Just, I just need to heat up her coffee. Maybe, maybe not on that. Oh! oh what do I do? Not everywhere. Oh, all right, okay. round two, round two. Good round idea, round hurry. Two. Oh, it's okay. I gotta, I gotta hurry. This, um... Yeah, she's doing it. Miss Grant, they were out of lattes, so here's coffee. Mm, and here you are delivering it to me like a normal, boring person. Well, that's that's what I am. I'm very boring and really normal. Mm -hmm. <laughs> so, um, so yeah, I'll just get out of your hair. Why? Have a building to leap in a single bound? <laughs> So <laughs> we're still going with that joke, <laughs> which is great because it's it's hilarious. <laughs> Kira, there are many topics that I find appropriate for humor: English cuisine, black lipstick. But I will never make a joke about a good story. Miss Grant, I'm sorry you think what you think, but it's not true. I'm not Supergirl. One time at a party, Paul McCartney swore to me that he and Yoko were the closest of friends. He was more convincing. I just, I don't want you to be embarrassed when you realize how wrong you are. Fine. We'll just keep playing this silly charade. You may go, Kira. I'm sure there's a phone in need of answering or a plane in need of catching. <laughs> <laughs>